Yeah, here we go. We're back in Ariadne. Yeah, so that was the first decision. Humanoid Meteora, Strength Dreams, Coco and Machia. That's like the informations we get. And now we leap to the beginning. What's gonna be like that? We're gonna kinda have Libra to change the decisions we made. Was that a dream? We can't skip still. Huh. Huh? Chloe, answer me! Chloe! Chloe? Sorry, I was asleep. Asleep and dreaming. Sorry to bug you when you're just waking up, but we need you in the lab now. Okay, I pretty much I'm gonna skip till something kind of happens differently, because it, this is the exactly thing that uh, did with Tokyo Kronos. We have to skip up until the moment something's different. General Dieter! If a... Hmm? Yes. Yes. While it normally functions wait, 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 by converting wait. their waves into energy that reflects back to them, if you don't use the counter assistance while converting and take the wave with your arm stretched out, you can scan for information. Scan for information? Yes, okay. What kind of information? So we're gonna change the course here. You try it. So while in battle with the first Meteora, we're gonna scan for information. Not reflect the What's this memory? energy. Chloe? Hmm? The plan is as I've explained to First Lieutenant Alba Iwaza. Okay. Carry it out quickly. That is all. Show them the power. Roger. Good luck out there. Chloe, wait. You sure your Grand Eyes layer level is alright? I can't confirm your link with Noah. Hmm. Oh, right. Hey! Hmm? Yes. Just how long do you think I've been shouting into your ear, huh? There you go. Messing with your dry eyes layer level and ignoring me again. You just do the worst things, you know that? <laughs> Ugh. Just what do you take me for anyway? Shut up. What was that? No one. We're moving in. I'm giving you a good talking to later, Chloe. Uh, this is different as well. Shut up. Why do you think I always set you to hidden? How, how could you say that? <laughs> Both of you, please. We're moving out. Huh? Fine. Whatever. Let's go. Let's shoot down this false star. Wait, so we're activating mirror? And then not let the reflection. Form wave contact on conversion barrier confirmed. Beginning conversion. I guess we do here. Analysis. Huh? Conversion aborted. Chloe, what happened? It's sorry. I've set the rail cannons firing up to 120%. Okay. As well as with rail cannon, what? we're not gonna shoot it. Please pull the trigger when it reaches 120%. Maybe that's gonna be different as well. So. Uh uh. Nope. Error in the aiming process. Control lost. What the hell? The meteor is reading stuff. What happened? Did the thing run away? Wait, you, you mean you let your sample? This is different because I tried as well, and the uh, Yamato killed uh, the meteora. Oh. Mission complete. Both units return. So because we absorb the energy from the phone wave, 
we could not shoot at all. Like, it was blocked. I tried earlier, and I wonder if I could at 120. Soft, too soft, both of you. Yeah, but it's different path now, right? Yeah, here's a split. Huh. Okay. Why is it that you can never catch me on Meteora? What are you, pacifist? Didn't you say you'd bag one no matter what? We chased off the Meteora and saved humanity. That's all that matters. What? Oh, far more! Let me tell you! Meteors are a veritable treasure trove of research material! Do you have any idea how much progress just one body could hold for the world? I swear! You always say that, so I have to ask you. You know what's different? Her voice. Now I is... Like, the voice acting is different. Do you have any idea how hard it is to capture one of those things? It's like more serious? Did they change the actors? <laughs> a meteor's remains disappear when you kill it. And if you try to catch them, they just run away in those weird holes of theirs. Just what do you want us to do? Sure, if it's really impossible to capture them, then those are the only choices we have. But in my eyes, it really doesn't look like you two are doing your best to wrangle one. Uh-oh. Especially you, Chloe. Oh, damn it. <laughs> are you even trying to capture one? Ugh. But you two have a point. Taking the safest option. I'll give you that. A logical idea. Hell, you could even say it's the right answer here. The right answer for a mere mediocrity. <laughs> but a genius cannot merely give up. Professor Julie always seeks ever greater heights. That's why I allowed you two together in the first place to make the impossible possible. An arc with high computational power and a design with great Machia synchronicity. Let this dream team let it go so easily. Put yourself in my shoes. Mm. Mm. Ugh, just where did that meteora run off to anyway? <laughs> right? It disappeared in the sky. Humanity has been forced to scrape by in this hole in the ground. And they're off having a nice vacation on the other side of the world? <laughs> Disgusting. All of them. I want to see more of the surface. The real sea. Real mountains. Ha! <laughs> sea! Mountains! Pfft, who cares? I've never been able to understand fools who spend their valuable time on movement. Besides, it's not set in stone that the Meteora go far when they get away. They may be a lot closer than we think. What do you mean? Those holes Meteora run into? Distance might not be the only thing they shorten. Get my drift? Mm. They may lead to tomorrow or yesterday or maybe even further back. Yeah, even... Is this something like time capsule? <clears throat> Julie? <clears throat> this, this new body works so well, it's gotten me a bit too loose, I think. Enough, get going, both of you. Make sure you do better next time. Huh, there was no launch, there was nothing. The city's surface is covered in textures. Showing where you are, who's hot, and who's not. Okay, this is the same, so I'm gonna skip. Oh, so we can skip to the decision, either ignore or apologize. So this time I'm gonna apologize. Chloe, did you lower your layer level again? So we just made a decision with the answer, but nothing changed for now, it seems like. Another decision? Fuck, I don't remember what I just said before. I think I shared suspicion before, so I'm gonna fall quiet. Oh, another choice. Oh, wait! There was no choice to watch her concert, we just straight up left. So we're gonna watch the concert. Just this once. <laughs> Noah? A wise decision. I'll give you a show you'll never forget. Interesting. Whoa. Oh, new sequence. Oh my god. Okay. It's too much. <laughs> Why my hands are vibrating? Oh. 
Uh. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Y'all are extra, Noah. Clapu clapu. <laughs> Coco. No. There's no way. Coco's dead. That's just a fabrication. I'd never believe one. Mm, okay. So we're back at home, I'm assuming. A yes. quiet room. What's that? Oh. Half of the photo in the memories? A picture? There's so much static, and I can only make out half of it. If I can find the other half of the data, I should be able to fix it with Prometheus's texture vision repair tool. It's obviously a photo of uh, Coco because of her ball in the back of the head, but... The sound. Oh, here. Well, that was easy. Broken data. Is this the other half of the picture data? It was in this room? Looks like it was. The repair tool is working. Should be fixed now. <laughs> it's just photo of her. What about it? It's Coco's. Good morning, Chloe. Okay, let's skip. Yes, ma'am. Did you sleep well? Yes, ma'am. Oh wait, this is not the same. She a was not saying ma yes ma'am. Though I do think it's a little lacking in information. There's a lot I want to go over. Now then, Chloe, my bodyguard, do sit. What? She's stuck? Huh. This decision was not here at all. I think we should refuse, maybe. This is like a fascinating kind of answer because we're her bodyguard, but like, what happens if you refuse? Not standing will deter my ability to act in case of emergency. Oh, okay, well, that way. You not sitting down will deter our ability to conversation. <laughs> Smart cookie. So just sit down. Yes, ma'am. Now, let's talk about something. I want to know about designs. Oh, okay. And about you, Chloe. Yes, ma'am. That really is a nice answer, but it doesn't make for a conversation. <laughs> How about you give us a topic? All you ever give me is yes ma'am or no ma'am, after all. Now, let's hear it. Uh... Hmm... Um... <sighs> hey Chloe, I think that one of the biggest conditions in any relationship is that you're interested in the other person. And communication. What is the definition of interested? Hmm... Perhaps I could call it curiosity instead yeah that's also true wanting to know why they did what they did acting on that curiosity i would say is the core uh -huh. of communication we should start by gathering questions i think chloe take a look at me yeah is there anything you're curious about i'm curious about the bow in the back mm. something's up with this your ribbon yeah huh 
You said before that you hate decorations, Miss Coco. But does the ribbon on the back of your head not function mainly as a decoration? Why have you put one on? So they can find me. Huh? It's like a signpost. Oh, okay. A sign to help me meet the person who gave me this ribbon again. The person? Who? What? I don't know. Not their face and not their name. I was given this ribbon so long ago, and I don't have any way of looking for them. But something tells me that if I keep wearing it, they'll find me someday. Huh. Hey, Chloe, do you think this ribbon looks good on me? <laughs> yeah, sure. Yes, ma'am. Really? Do you want one too, then? <coughs> I'll have one prepared for you. Um. Yes, ma'am. Oh, well, that was fast, Chloe. Hmm. So you're not serious about it, then? Don't disappoint me like that. Hmm. I may not be able to see. But I'm sensitive when it comes to matters of the heart. So no lies or false praise around me, okay? Understood? Mm -hmm. Understood. Good answer. You know, I was sure you would ask why I was blind. Or why I couldn't walk. Was that the condition? I think we, you already know. That caught your eye. I have never thought it strange that you were blind, Miss Coco. Oh. Oh no? Why is that? It is difficult for me to put into words why. Oh no, don't run away from your words. You can't communicate if you don't say it clearly. Not to me, and not to yourself. Think. Take your time and choose your words. We have nothing but time. Hmm. Hmm. The conditions that ail your eyes and legs were not chosen by you, Miss Coco. They can be thought of as misfortunes that befell mm. you without your consent. Hmm. You're right about that. I didn't choose any of this. But... Your ribbon... That's something that... Whatever the reason... Sure. You chose yourself. And you're right about that, too. I chose to wear this ribbon myself. I think I wanted to hear your reason. I wanted to know how you made choices. But when mm. I think about why I wanted to know that, I find myself unsure again. Very well done. Allow me to give you the answer then. Oh. You see, Chloe, you've started to take interest in me. Interest? Right. Interest. The desire to know someone and understand how they think. That's interest. Remember that. Because that's mostly how I've felt about you since <laughs> Leave me alone. we met. The same interest, the same pulse. We're a lot like one another, you know. Sure. Okay, but at home. Why were you here? Ah, because of her singing. No, what? Uh, she's at it again. What are you doing? I told you not to come into my house. I apologize for that because I'm a good girl. <laughs> this time, though, this is an emergency. An emergency? I haven't heard any meteor alerts. Well, I'll tell you myself. Oh my, my god. No, uh. I came here myself just so you could make it on time. Uh, and why would I go to your show? There have been too many Meteora attacks lately, so I haven't had the chance to put on shows. The townspeople must be chomping at the bits to hear my angelic voice. Of course. When are you going to start listening to me anyway? Oh, and the last song is a duet with you. What? Our duo name is going to be Noah plus one. <laughs> why plus? Am I a side chick? I sent you the song last night, remember? Uh, and I deleted it the second I got it. Ooh. Y you deleted it. I put my heart and soul into it. And you just mercilessly deleted it? That's... That's awful. Okay, uh, uh, yeah, I'm gonna reassure. <laughs> this is a little the bit fucked up. Can be recovered. Then I will forgive. 
I'm very merciful, you see. Hey, Chloe, I keep saying this, but this sunroom security is way too tight. There's no way for me to get in. Because it should end. <laughs> and I keep telling you, this was Coco's special place. And I'm not the one who locked you out. Uh -oh. Don't lie to me. Who else would be so mean? Anyway, just open up. I want to see the Dahlias. I really, really, really want to see them. Huh. Quit hogging all... Huh? Oh. Chloe, we're here to hang <laughs> out. Well, shit. <laughs> Two extra intruders. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry for the sudden intrusion, Chloe. An intrusion needs more than a sorry. Well, whatever. Yamada wanted to invite you and wouldn't listen to me. Still, I'm on his side here. Welcome, Alba. And, uh, who are you again? What? <laughs> whatever. Savage. Yamato. Come on, Noah, remember my name. <laughs> sorry, sorry. My memory is highly advanced. You oh see. my god. Its system deletes unneeded <laughs> Wait, you got all your songs memorized. Songs are valuable, unlike you. Jesus. Hey, I'm pretty valuable too. Mm. There's so much life in the flowers and leaves. It's a beautiful sight. I guess. It feels like you can truly tell how much you care about them just by looking, Chloe. Yeah. Know what I can tell from looking at these flowers? They're real, like, uh, red. <sighs> Shut up, Yamato. Everyone's going to know how dumb you are. <laughs> Look, I can just tell they're beautiful. But hey, no matter how pretty the flowers are, if you hang around them 24-7, neither of you can actually recharge. So you gotta go outside sometimes, with us. How about the central area? The central area? Then you two should come see my show. A Noah concert? That sounds good. Then it's settled. I'm gonna cheer so hard. Come with us, Chloe. I guess. It seems like the decisions go all around just hanging out with them and just like kinda being more communicative. Because last time we were just pretty much refusing everything, so... I'm just uh, gonna go with the flow. I won't stick around, okay? 